Hydrothermal explosions reveal stunning new features in a beloved national park. As if Yellowstone National Park wasn't already a major tourist attraction, officials say a new blue pool has been discovered in the park's porcelain basin area, the U.S. Geological survey reports that Yellowstone National Park geologists discovered the new thermal feature in the Norris Geyser Basin on April 10 while performing routine maintenance at a temperature recording station. When the geologists traveled to the Norris Geyser Basin, it was their first visit to the area since the previous fall, the agency noted. The geologists were captivated by the new blue spring that had been present there since last year. The blue pool is located in the porcelain basin subbasin of the Norris Geyser Basin, just west of a patch of vegetation informally known as Tree Island. The U.S. Geological Survey stated that the Blue Pool likely formed during a series of small eruptions between late December 2024 and early February 2025. This conclusion is based on collected satellite data, which indicates that no features appeared on the west side of Tree Island before the 19th of December 2024. The U.S. Geological Survey also stated that, on the 6th of January 2025, a small depression had formed in the area, and an image from the 13th of February 2025 showed a pool of water, indicating that the feature had fully formed by that time. Geologists concluded that the rocks and white material, silica mud, surrounding the pool were likely ejected when the feature formed. However, there were several low-level acoustic signals emanating from the direction of the new feature, the agency said. The clearest signals were recorded on the 25th of December 2024, but the sound was relatively weak and there was no associated seismic signal something that would be expected with a major eruption. Similar acoustic signals were recorded on January 15 and the 11th of February 2025, but again there was no seismic signal. Amidst growing excitement, geologists and park officials continue to closely monitor the new vent. Continuous monitoring ensures that visitors can safely enjoy Yellowstone's geothermal wonders. Real-time data collected by the Yellowstone Volcano Observatory helps scientists track changes, predict developments, and provide park visitors with the latest safety information. The interplay between natural forces and careful management remains a delicate balancing act. Yellowstone's ability to attract millions of tourists annually while maintaining its fragile geothermal ecosystem is a testament to careful planning and vigilant oversight. Hydrothermal features are common in Yellowstone National Park. In fact, the area is home to more than half of the world's total hydrothermal vents, Nevertheless, the magma chamber beneath the volcano heats groundwater enough to create and activate geysers, hot springs, and bubbling mud pots. And if you're worried about Yellowstone erupting anytime, don't worry. If such structures are common in Yellowstone, what makes this new discovery unique? Mike Poland, a scientist who heads the Yellowstone Volcano Observatory, 